Hey guys, Retro Badger here. Hope you're all well. Today we've had a request and it's to put the Daedalus from Stargate SG-1 against the Venator from Star Wars. Now the Venator is equipped with a multitude of weapons. It's a very large and powerful ship. This version of the Daedalus is equipped with railguns and tactical nuclear weapons. It does, however, come with Asgard shields. I fear the Venator may have an advantage here, but the Daedalus is capable of launching F-302s. Let's see what happens. Okay, here we go. Whoops. Well, that was a good demonstration of uh, all of the railguns then, actually. So we could call it a test. Let's fire missiles. I'm not sure what these missiles are going to do to the shields of a Venator. Oh. Is there a bit slow? Are they actually going to hit? Oh, right. They've impacted, but... Uh... Oh, no! Negligible damage. I was too busy watching the missiles. Okay, let's pretend that never happened. Now this time, I'm going to launch some fighters, and I've only just discovered this, but if you go to Safi, you go to multi-vector mode, you can launch a wing of fighters. How cool is that? I never knew that existed. So hopefully, this should prove a good distraction. That's so cool. Now, the Daedalus, funnily enough, also has a puddle jumper in its bay, but every time I try launching it, the game crashes, so... <laughs> I think I'll have to leave that unless we get really desperate. Okay, so we are causing some damage. That's pretty good. I don't want to get too close, for obvious reasons. Let's fire our nukes. Ah, okay, so, some full damage. Those missiles are hitting. And we've not taken any damage yet, so our shields are still at 100%, which is good. I wonder if we can launch another wing. Oh, I hope the game doesn't crash. Ah, uh, no. Okay, we're starting to take damage. Oh, the Star Wars weapons are quite powerful, but a Venator is powerful. From my basic understanding of Imperial ships. Oh, don't miss. How can... What the heck? What happened then? Oh, that's so weird. Well, I think it's time to bring in some help from the Asgard. So now we should have the plasma beam weapons. Ah, here we go. We still have our nukes, of course. Oh, yeah, that's, <laughs> that's way more effective. Can we launch a wing still? Oh, we can! How did I not know this? Okay, so they're being a very good distraction for us. Oh, look at that! The power of Asgard technology, right there. We're just punching holes in the ship. I am going to do this the other way around as well. There we go! Victory! 
And will the F-302s... Oh, no! It's taken them out! Oh, dear. Okay, so we're going to go against the Asgard upgraded Daedalus class ship. Wow. So we've got some pretty decent firepower on this ship. We're firing the Asgard tech. Let's uh, increase past the shields. We're getting through that forward shield of theirs. Oh my. Game of chicken, eh? They're flying right at us. Got him! I think. Victory for the Venator. Oh, look at the size difference. Well, despite the damage, I have to give that to the Venator. That was a much faster victory. The computer didn't launch any F-302s, but even if it had done, if I destroyed the Odyssey, it would have taken them out. What do you guys think of that result? Thanks for watching, and if you enjoyed the video, please like and subscribe. Bye for now.